Wow, I actually can't believe I just got that weapon. I would just open them up, hoping. I was literally hoping to get a new DLC weapon because, guys, the days of summer just dropped, and there's like five DLC weapons: it's the Vendetta Sniper, the Ballistic Knife, the Peacekeeper, the Galil's coming with a challenge, or the Grav, which is the Galil, right? Either way, there's a bunch of new DLC weapons in the game, and but they're all in supply drops instead of actually being in the pack, which is awful. Complete awful. And check this out. Guaranteed no dupe ranged or mark 2 weapon from the reserves. Which means it's guaranteed it's weapon. It, you think it's a weapon, right? But it's not. You don't get a new DLC weapon guaranteed like back in Black Ops 3, which was like, oh, a guaranteed DLC weapon? That's sick. This one, you get guaranteed a, a version 2 of any weapon in the game, like mark 2 weapons. Like, it can be a normal weapon, just a mark 2, which is like a heroic variant or whatever of it, or a DLC weapon. So it's like you're not even guaranteed a new weapon or even a DLC weapon at all. Which is so scummy. And then, we finally get the Vendetta Sniper on the 50th tier. Which should have been in the game last season. Or, well, it should have been in the Grand Heist, actually. Like, this was supposed to be coming out months ago, guys. And they pushed it back this far because... Worst microtransactions ever. This is the worst thing ever, guys. This Vendetta should be free for everyone because... We have literally been waiting for the Sniper for months. It should have been... It wasn't even supposed to be in this pack. It was supposed to be in last time... Uh, Spectre Rising, the original, it was supposed to be in there, guys, and then, or it was supposed to be in the freaking Hot Pursuit thing, or the Cop Operation, or whatever it was called, the Grand Heist, it was supposed to be in the Grand Heist, but then they changed it over here because, like, I don't know why, it's not even a good sniper, it's a semi-auto with a three-hit kill, like, it's, a wor it's the wor it's worst sniper in the game, and then they have the audacity to give us this instead of an actual DLC, no, or no dupe DLC weapon, like, come on, dude, like, at least give us a new weapon instead of, um, it could be a Mark II, so it could literally be any weapon. It could be MX-9 Mark II, it could be the GKS Mark II, the SOG Mark II if there's one out there. Like, come on. At least they gave us Grind, which is a Black Ops 2 map. Even if you don't want the Black Ops Pass, you still get Grind. So that's cool, I guess. But it's not like we can actually play it since, like, no, not a lot of people have the Black Ops Pass, so good luck trying to find a match. We don't have to go in custom games to even play this map. <sighs> I'm gonna Black Ops 4 learn. Modern Warfare, please be good to us. So they did they they did one good thing by giving this this free map, but like if we like what's the point of having the Black Ops Pass if they give this map, which is the best map in the DLC or any any new map that they added, this is probably the best one by far. And it's free for everyone. Not that I'm complaining. I mean I did get the Black Ops Pass, but I still like the fact that everyone gets the map so I can actually play it without being super laggy, so that's good. I actually didn't have this DLC weapon, so I at least got a new DLC weapon, but like, I don't want this. How many shots does it take? Jeez. This thing's kind of trash, though. But, like, guys, what they should have done is since we have the Black Ops Pass, we should have got something good. Like, I say we get a couple of the DLC weapons for free. Or, or actually, no, the DLC weapons that are, like, in the supply drops, if you have the Black Ops Pass, they're, they're also in the normal tier system progression. So, if you don't have the Black Ops Pass, you have to spend money on supply drops. But if you do have the, have the Black Ops Pass, you can just earn it by... Go leveling up or whatever. That's literally the best way they could have done that. The thing that makes me mad is the fact that they have a, a no dupe Mark II and maybe a DLC weapon. That's so stupid. They they can't even give us like the ballistic knife instead of the tw on 25. Cause like last season we get it. We're supposed to get a DLC weapon like every 25 tiers. That's why 25, 50, 75, maybe 100. But like they didn't. So it kind of made me upset. And I'll, like I'm I'm happy that Peacekeeper's back though like at least we get the galil if everyone um gets 15 million matches played or something like that it's gonna be easy for the call of duty community so that's good so the glue is coming for us if we got if we don't make it though <laughs> i'm gonna be very disappointed but guys how do you like days of summer it's sick kind of Ooh, i suck Ooh, get wrecked i'm so bad I'm so bad i'm playing with bots sadly this is the only way i can actually enjoy this map because I Alexa, stop. Sadly, this is the only way I can actually enjoy the map. Because good luck trying to find a DLC lobby that's not laggy in this game. I guess that's just how it is sometimes, you know? I cannot wait until Modern Warfare to where we actually get into good matches. I was scared. Just got destroyed! Now, let's be honest, guys. Grind is honestly probably the best DLC map that's ever, like, released. Like, I remember playing this on Black Ops 2, dude. I was so happy for this map. This map was sick in Black Ops 2. This was amazing. 
And now we have the Peacekeeper. Dude, I love the Peacekeeper. The best DLC weapon ever, dude. My, It was the first DLC weapon to ever be a, actually a thing. Let's be honest, guys. It was, it's the best. You cannot go wrong with a Peacekeeper. This gun's kind of fire, but at the same time, I don't know. I don't really use shotguns ever, so... It's kind of trash. <laughs> Let's go off right now. Dun, 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 dun. Dun, 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 dun. Dun, 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 dun. Dun, 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 dun. Dun, 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 I keep thinking this is the SWAT. Is it just me or doesn't this look like the SWAT? I'm just like, maybe I'm just stupid. Maybe, I don't know. I'm gonna use the SWAT a bit. That was terrible. Anyway, guys, I guess that's gonna be it. Um, I don't know. I'm kind of disappointed with the Days of Summer update. I figured there'd be more DLC weapons actually in the tier system, but they're in supply drops. And it's like, I even have the Black Ops Pass, so I thought like maybe it like would give me something since I, I it just seems like the Black Ops Pass is kind of pointless to be honest. I don't know. I don't even want the DLC maps to be honest with you. So, it seems kind of pointless. Modern Warfare is going to save Call of Duty hopefully, and it will not have the Black Ops Pass or Modern Warfare Pass or whatever they would have called it. It's going to be lit, and I guess that's going to be it guys. going to go ahead and give this game an uninstall, not really, but anyway guys, peace.